Happ will make the start for the Blue Jays in this series opener, and Happ has pitched well. Oh, you're going to get the best he has to offer. And a swing and a miss, and a pitch up in the zone, two down. Porcello, a perfect 4 0 in his four starts. Anytime you have a 1 2 like that. Good change up right there to get him swinging. 3 2. And there's a walk, just the second given up. 2 2 on the way, and then he freezes him with a fastball over the inner half. And not this time, though. Porcello strikes out three in the bottom of the first. So much better during the regular season than he did during spring training. There's a diving stop by Travis back to his feet and on to first in time to get J.D. Martinez. Martinez hits the ball very well to the opposite field. And you can see Travis quickly gets up and fires the first to retire him. A terrific play by Devin. The mix of this team has really been good, and I think the chemistry has been terrific. Do a little bit more damage with the bat. Runner is going, and it's swung on and bounced to the right side. And with a hit and run on, it'll go through. Not hit hard. And Pilar swinging a chopper to Ward. Third coming home is Devers, and it's a wide throw, and the run will score. Again, the aggressiveness of the Blue Jays. You can't slug toe to toe when you don't have your big horses. Really, two weakly hit ground balls. And here's Diaz, and he hits a double play ball to short. Red Sox get one, and that's it with the momentum deep enough to bring home Martin. Another chopper to third. Devers coming home again. And this time they get Martin at the plate. That one will get away from Leon, and the runners are going to advance. Off Devers, he can't find it, and two runs will come in for the Blue Jays. And a swing and a miss to get him and end the inning. He's in his sixth season in the big leagues right now. So he hits a weak chopper towards second. Travis got a hurry and can't get it out of his bare hand cleanly in time. And he got him. Again the 0-2. And a swing and a miss to get a hold. Two down. There he goes. And the 3-2 inside corner strike three called. Boy, he brings a lot of energy. Something that John Gibbons really likes about his play. Porcello gets him again. 3-2. And a swing and a miss at a high fastball. That's six strikeouts. And a swing and a miss, and Ben Intendi upset with himself. He got jammed. This He's is gonna get it. Well, I'll tell you what. I don't think Hernandez ever saw it and they looked at each other Diaz looked out to Hernandez and Hernandez wasn't close with free agents this way it took a while to get him signed in the majors Devers with a ground ball to short Diaz up with it and across the diamond and that's all strike three call and a swing and a miss and Pilar strikes out. The 2 2. And Porcello strikes out the side. One, two. Strike three. You see Kevin Pilar with uh, his eye black saying, instead of Blue Jays, he's got hashtag Toronto Strong. Granderson rips one. That gets right through the shift all the way to the right field fence, and he's at second base. Ranks among major league facilities and what it needs. As Hernandez slices the ball to right center and a diving catch by Betts to save a run. But Betts dives, took some good angle, and didn't get much on the throw in his haste to get it back to the infield. But what an effort by Mookie Betts. He's as good as there is in right field, and Porcello certainly appreciates the effort. And draws a walk. Liner and Holt is there to make the catch, and that is all. There's a base hit down the left field line, and Hernandez lets the ball play him just a little bit. Probably wouldn't have mattered in the end as Holt's at second base. 
Got him again. Strikes him out for the third time tonight. Hit on the ball that glanced off the glove of Diaz. Here's a liner to center field. It's down for a base hit in front of Pilar. And rounding third coming in to score is Holt on the RBI single that has the Red Sox on the board. Runner goes. And a swing and a miss. Got him. Nasty slider at the bottom of the zone. Ryan Gibbons going to the bullpen for right hander Ryan Tapera. 1 2. And that one's going to sneak through into right field for a base hit. Did he go? Yes, he did. And I Sonia rings him up at the plate. And the pitch. Got him. Joe Kelly, he's got the best fastball on the Red Sox bullpen. No two to smoke. And he chases a breaking ball in the dirt. Two down. Here he is, Roberto Asuna on looking for save number seven. And a base hit in the left field to lead off the top of the ninth inning. The 2 2. Did he go? Yes, he did. Big swing, and it looked like he offered at it, and Iasonia made the call. 2 2 on the way. Jams him, and it's over the head of Travis in a right field, a base hit. And the Red Sox have two men on. Again, the 0 2. And it's lined into right center for a base hit. One run is home. Being held at third on the play is Devers on a long single by Nunez that brings Boston within a run. And he got him. Two down. Martin wants another fastball. Perfectly located on the outside corner for strike two. Up to second on the play, though, goes Nunez. Ball four to load the bases. And a long inning gets a little bit longer for Roberto Asuna. A grind of an inning against the Red Sox. And there's a base hit into left field that will tie it. Nunez getting the way. Throw to the plate in plenty of time. And that will end it. Got to be short and quick. That's a fair ball. Pass to diving Devers. And Pilar on his way to second base and in there with a two out double. Came out to go over the scouting report. They got a fastball that flowers it into him. Ricky Betts is there and the Blue Jays will leave Pilar on and that means we are going to extra innings. Tenth in a 3-3 tie and the new pitcher is right hander Tyler Clipper. And Clipper visibly unhappy. That And a one hop smash to short to second one on to first double play. Meanwhile, we go bottom 10, and here's Craig Kimbrell. The 2 2. And that's strike three called, and no argument from Travis. 2 0. And a swing and a high fly ball, deep right field, and this game is over. At 37 years of age, he can still turn one around. And he does it to give the Blue Jays a walk-off win. As Granderson takes one of the very best in the game deep, and it, Buck, it was a no-doubter. No-doubter for sure. He got that fastball out over the plate, and this one was gone the moment it hit the bat. Way up there, off the facing of that fourth deck, and Curtis, he squared it up. His third home run of the season, and as we mentioned, his fourth career walk-off home run.